You've got some kind of disguise lined up, right? Yep. All set. Hope so. You'd be a little conspicuous just walking the streets. Relax, Kev. I'll blend right in. Yeah. Well, <laughs> just get into the sewer system ASAP. Hopefully anyone who notices you will just mind their own business. You sure you want the K-9000 there along for this one? I had the good doctor make some adjustments along with the repairs. Remote piloting and AI wiping have been disabled. So yeah, I say let's throw them a bone. Wordplay. My exoskeleton resembles a K-9. K-9s enjoy bones. Amusing on two levels. Let's go. It's right. I'm in the sewer system. All right, let's get started. Your mission's to investigate the Desperado Affiliated Research Center somewhere in that area. According to the intel from our client, the lab's been dumping illegal waste into those sewers. FYI, they're also involved with the cartels in human trafficking. Allegedly, anyway. <sighs> this just gets better and better. Tell me about it. We need you to infiltrate the lab and find out everything you can. Of course, you'll have to find it first. We still don't know the exact location. So I'm looking for anywhere the lab might hook up with the sewers? Yep. If they're actually dumping waste, they've got to link up somehow. Find that connection, sneak into the lab, and see if you can find evidence implicating them on anything. No problem. Stealth's my specialty. Right. Well, we'll see. Do we have any idea what kind of research they're doing there? Not really. Maybe something related to all the people they're trafficking. Like experimentation? It's possible. First things first, though. Find a way into that lab. Oh, right. It says here the locals say black crocodiles live in those sewers. So, you know, uh, watch out. <laughs> black crocodiles? Could they be talking about UGs? Maybe just an urban legend. But still, be careful. I will scout ahead. You will provide backup. <laughs> sir, yes, sir. Commence operation. Right. Unidentified UGs are patrolling the sewers. Exercise caution.
I see a maintenance catwalk. Use it to conceal yourself if necessary.
Estás bien? What you say? Oh. Me a Guyanese from Guyana. You speak English? Uh, yeah. I'm from America. Call me Ryden. Me name George, like Georgetown. George. And just like all damn America president. Yeah. So what are you doing here? Me? What the rest of you do here? You lose the map of Ninja Hideout, Ninja Man? <laughs> no. I'm looking for bad guys. Our damn Skunter Research Lab. You know about it? Me know me now go back. Hey, you're not one of them Skunt, nah? Nah, I guess you're all right. If you're a cyborg, you know who Day is? Sort of. What happened to you? Oh, me been live on the street, raking scraper above, nah? Then this good need dressed like the mafia say, Hey, boy, you want a job? What the worst gonna happen, nah? What that mother scone don't put me on a ras boat? They pack us all a pickable doji container, next thing we know, we're here, at that jumbi lab. All kids, like you? Yeah, a lot of boy. But then me been over here what them scone wanna do. Snuff us out. And got all day organ. So you ran? Uh-huh. It's shame me not a bad-ass robot ninja man, same as you! Ha! <laughs> me been strongest cyborg ever. Warlock all them phantoms and black clothes that I pass me. Starting to sound like a bad guy yourself. Just plain, nah? Me done plenty bad thing. But me not kill no man. Nah, never. Good. We tried to warn the boy. I say, I would his brain would get cut out. Run your ass out of there. But them boy with me no understand. They like Spanish or something. So me the only one for escape. Then that machine come after me and... And I know the rest. George, <laughs> I need every detail about how you escaped. Oh. So the kid got into the sewers through a drainage channel? Yeah, he says the channel is super tight, but there's some kind of shutter next to it. Got it. That must be where they dump the waste. There's something else. It sounds like a Desperado exec was on site yesterday. If a sentry cyborg was on hand for the meeting... You should be able to review their video log, provided you can find a server access terminal. That would give us the evidence we need, as well as a little peek at the level of that technology. So what about the kid? I made sure the area was secure and told him to sit tight. Can you pick him up? Sure. I'll send a couple agents for him. You just focus on getting into that lab. If what he said is true about the organs, we need to hurry. Agreed. Riding out. that gonna help? Oh, it's for medical supplies. That could work, actually.
intercepted call for backup during your last fight. The caller's position is on your soliton radar. You can engage if you wish. It is your choice.
well hidden, I gotta say. This would appear to be the UG maintenance area. You should find a terminal there. Something they use to upload mission parameters to the UGs. And something I can use to access the lab's main server? Perhaps. But first you need to take a dump. I... wait, what? A dump? A digital optical output mounted proxy. You'll need one to interface with the terminal. Most any UG should suffice. A tripod or the like. I'll see what I can come up with. How do I use it? Simply connect to it. You should be able to use your communications outlet to control the proxy UG. All right, let's give it a shot. If they continue to increase security, they may shut out all outside network connections. Please do your best to avoid being seen. Yeah. 
it over. For now, yeah. But that room, those were cyborg brain casings. Duh, we saw. George said they were harvesting organs from kids. Yes, this must be why they are trafficking children. Perhaps other organs are being sold elsewhere, but they are definitely taking their brains. Jesus, are they making these kids into cyborgs? Wait, the cyborgs you've been fighting, did they seem like they might be kids? You said earlier that child soldiers have a telltale approach to combat. Yeah, but I didn't see it here. Those weren't kids. So, what? Desperado's just doing the surgeries there? We've got to do something about all those brains. And the other kids George was talking about. He just escaped a few hours ago. They couldn't have taken all their brains out that fast. True. There could still be a bunch of kids they haven't touched yet. I better move. input terminal. These guys are pretty jumpy now. Any funny business, and they might just open fire. Try latching onto Cyborg's heads from behind. Then, an electric shock should knock them unconscious. is most likely designed to download mission data and such into the UGs. Let's try using it to access the lab server. Titan, I found something. In one of the Sentry Cyborg's visual logs. Guess who shows up? Patch it through. Right away. kids in Liberia. Of course, it's right straight to the brain now. It feels as real as anything else. Your work is astonishing. And your work is light. We need to sit before our cover is blown. We've got some assholes snooping around. We just do not have the full quantity yet. Each brain has its own unique requirements. It's not like we can just pop them out with an ice cream scoop. <laughs> All right. Make your point. Oh, thank you for understanding. Say what you have now. I'll destroy any unharvested inventory. Okay? But have you any idea what they cost? Last night, actually, my children weren't exactly rare in the part of the world. Millions of them, in fact. You can get more once we set up a new lab. They lead lives of hunger and pain. We're performing a service here for them and the cities they burden. 
But just gathering the donors required a significant investment. Yes, yes. Yes, you'll get the money. Accounting will be in touch. Gracias. I assure you we will dispose of our inventory in the instant we can confirm payment. Are we done here? I've got a full slate today. Tecumse is a demanding mistress. And America has suffered long enough. Oh, yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Let me see you out. You see that, Kev? Imani's killer. Desperado's chief of operations goes by Sundowner, the Californian wildfire. The kids. Think we're too late? Only one way to find out. George was still alive. Maybe the payment hasn't come through yet. Hmm, maybe. But you heard what he said. They've already started some brains on VR training. There must be more than just what I found here. What about the VIP in the suit? I'll find out. He definitely seemed familiar. Right. I'm going after the kids. George. What? Maybe the coordinates you sent us were off? No way. I merged the GPS location of our entry with all my movement data from that point on. This is bad. You think they got to him first? I don't know. I'll have our guys sweep the area. Thanks. I better keep moving. Walking the way. Push that thing back.
I knew I'd seen that guy before. Stephen Armstrong. As in Colorado Senator Stephen Armstrong. They're already talking about him as a shoe-in for the nomination in 2020. And get this. Two years ago, a federal grand jury investigated his ties to a certain private... World Marshal. One of the biggest PMCs out there. I remember. The biggest ever since the Big Five split up. Not to mention the single largest investor in military cyborg R&D in the world. Guess that answers the question of who's backing Desperado. Marshall and Desperado in bed together. Should make for some fun headlines. Headlines? This is World Marshal and a U.S. Senator we're talking about. There won't be any headlines. Even without the Patriots filter, no major media outlet will investigate allegations like these. It'd be financial and political suicide. So we just what? Sit back while they keep carving up kids, stand aside while they build an army of cyborgs? You heard them. We shut down one lab, they build another. They're planning something big, Kev. We can't just wait for it to happen. We need to hit them first and hit them hard where it counts. No, Raiden, no. I know what you're thinking and just no. Colorado is in America, and America has these things called laws. Mm-hmm. And law enforcement in Denver was privatized and farmed out to... Marshall, yes, so what? There are still laws, and it's their headquarters for Christ's sakes. You'd be heading right into the heart of a raging shitstorm. I didn't say it would be easy. We'll figure it out once the kids are safe. Jesus Christ! Kevin, out! Artificial blood cryopreserver. They must have begun preparatory freezing. What do you mean? That device is filled with synthetic blood plasma. It can slow the metabolism of a harvested organ, circulating this plasma to sustain oxygen levels. You can preserve an arm, a brain, any body part for several hours. So what are they freezing, and why? I could not say. Perhaps they plan to sell off the organs of the children they were told to dispose of. Unbelievable. You had best hurry, right? Right. Anesthetic in smaller doses. But breathe too much of it? And adios, muchachos! Break that glass, and I'll blow his brains out! Ugh. 
Surrender! Or decide the needs of the many or the needs of the few. Right in. Don't worry about me now. Quiet, pendejo! <laughs> Surrender! I won't ask again. George, are you sure? Hmm? Hmm. I'm ready. Me life now so precious. Ching, what if me can take this scunt to hell with me? Cállate! Stop it! Now! I'll kill him, I swear! 